What is going on, guys? It is a beautiful morning this morning. The sun is just starting to come up. We are fishing out here at a local lake for largemouth bass. We have our neighbor Rick with us today. And of course, out here with my dad. We are on the boat, we are largemouth fishing, and this is the very first gummy worm fishing challenge ever on this channel. Check out the bait lineup. We have Haribo. Haribo, is that how you say it? Snakes. We are using nothing but gummy worms this morning. It is summertime, so it gets very hot. We're only gonna fish probably till about 11 or so. Oh look, these are stuck together. You know, I'm actually gonna leave them stuck together. Oh, okay, that's just the way they come. They literally, they come two snakes. Oh, <laughs> I just flipped one of those. Okay, well they come two snakes stuck together. Do you, you wanna uh, use yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, those are good color too, the chartreuse. Uh, yes, the chartreuse, that's actually a perfect color. And then we have here, this is, I've never seen this. This is called the All-Star Mix Trolley. They have little, people. I guess we'll get to that in a second. That's kind of a weird color. We have octopus. Check out that. That is going to come. In fact, I'm going to set that guy. That is a special one. We're going to set that off to the side. We have, let's see, where's a llama? I know we have llamas in here. There we go. We got a llama rolling. The llama might come into play. And then the one I'm most confident about out of all of them, simply because we've caught trout. I've never caught a bass on the gummy lure. lure. Uh, but we have caught trout on these before and this is actually what I'll start off with is a nice little gummy worm there First ever gummy fishing challenge. So I'm just gonna rig this gummy worm just like you would any other um, Plastic bait just Texas rig got a pegged 1 8 ounce sinker. We're fishing pretty shallow water. You don't need a lot of weight pegged sinker and there you go guys and so we have a Texas rigged Gummy worm right there, black forest gummy worm. Let's see how this works. Oh, guys, I got one. I got one on a gummy worm. Yes, on a gummy worm. A literally, it's huge too. Guys, I got one. Look at that, it's huge, it's yeah, huge, it is, it's a it tank. You got it? Yeah, I got it. It's a tank. Are you kidding me? You wanna, yeah, like, I was gonna say we can put it bigger. Oh, there it is. Look at it, look at it. You grab it, Mr. Yeah, don't worry about that, don't worry about got that. It. Just Got it, got it. Look at oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> like second cast. Nice. Fit. Oh my goodness! On I want to see the gummy worm. No, look, the gummy worm fell off. Must have fallen off in the fight. Oh it's not. It's kind of brittle. Oh Holy mackerel! That's like the biggest large round I've caught all year on this lake. Scale out. Wow. That is cool. That is crazy, guys. Like the second cast of the day. Big bucket now, guys. Unfortunately, our scale or our, yeah our scale is not it's out the batteries aren't working but this is an almost 20 inch largemouth good grief this is probably solid four pounder probably um yeah the willy go, go board has them put it over four pounds that is a my biggest this is guys this is the biggest bass of the year for me right here <laughs> on a gummy word that is crazy the second it was either the second or third cast of the day my biggest <laughs> bass of the year on a gummy worm. I thought at the start of this day, if I catch one fish on something gummy, I'll be super happy. And so that's just, that's amazing. So I'm not taking anything for granted. Let's see if we can get another fish on this. You know guys, I had planned on using some of these octopus and stuff next, and I will. But I wanna see if I can get another one on just the regular gummy worm, red and green. There we go. Let's give it a go. These octopus and llamas and snakes they'll come into play later oh you had one fallen oh my dad just had one follow up on his uh on his gummy this is funny here i've been wasting money on five dollar packs of baits and i could have been uh i could have been a dollar, bag of, a dollar bag of gummy worms you know that'd be funny as a fish a whole tournament with nothing but gummy worms <laughs> Guys, I'm going to switch up to an orange and yellow one. They kind of come off the hook easily. 
So we might go through this bag pretty fast, but if we can catch bass like that, <laughs> check that out. <laughs> You're talking about colors yeah. of gummy yeah, worms. Gummy worms for baits. <laughs> you know, I just had a theory. I want, you know, this lake is, uh, guys, this lake is so highly pressured. Um, and it's actually quite difficult to fish sometimes because of all the people that fish it. But I wonder if gummy worms, bass haven't seen that before. So maybe it's like something unusual that they've never seen and it smells different than anything they've ever seen. And so who knows? And I'm not trying to jinx the day just because we caught one, but we'll see if we catch more. But that's an, a theory. <laughs> Guys, I think I might have had a bite right there. And they pull apart easily. I think, I think a fish came up. Just all right, guys, check it out. I'm switching to a little, you know what I'm doing? I'm going to make it kind of Carolina rig a little bit. This uh, octopus. See if we can catch something on a gummy octopus. Oh, yeah, I'm getting a bite. Come on. Crap. I stole my gummy octopus. Dang it. Let's see if the llama turns things around. How do you even hook a llama? I'm gonna hook the llama through the foot and then put the hook point in his head. There we go. I think it'll be good action in the water. Oh, I missed him. I did on the llama. That was, he started take off with it. Dang it. Grabbed the llama, pulled him off, almost pulled him off the hook. I call this one Cusco. Ah, not very big. <laughs> My dad has one. Finally, though, good dude. It's been a tough morning of fishing. Besides, it's man, it's been good for me, but <laughs> with my gummy worms. I don't mm. know, man. <laughs> I, don't, I wouldn't say that turned our day around. No, no. On but a it got the monkey. Got the monkey off my back. Yeah. Pretty little large now. Nice. Got one. On a gummy worm. He snagged. He snagged, though. Oh, my line was tangled. I was wondering what was... Did you see that? I just had a... You gotta go after him? Mm-hmm. Oh, I can still feel him on there. He's still on there. Yeah, I got a little one playing with mine over here. Dang it. Look, there he is, there he is. Oh, oh, look, the gummy worm just flew off. Yes! <laughs> Unbelievable. Man. Another gummy worm fish. Whoa, that was that was crazy. Got snagged. I thought. Oh my gosh. I tell you what, Rick, I don't know what to say. I, I don't know. I, here's what I think. So these bass are just used to eating protein all day. And they see that little sweet little snack. I know. <laughs> They've never seen anything like it before. Wow, Asa. Guys, second gummy worm fish ever. Another, another like solid fish. I've switched back to, in fact, I'll show you guys what I switched to. Because I caught this one on a different one. I've been trying just like every gummy worm in the pack. If you catch another one like that, like that mm -hmm. we're throwing you off the boat. <laughs> you to... Caught that one on the Black Forest ones, but this time it was an orange and yellow gummy worm. I've been throwing everything. We can throw octopus, sloths, dinosaurs, everything. We got snakes, and this is so far the one that's produced just the straight up regular gummies. Tell you what, maybe it's a finesse day. And I tell you, maybe the sugar's coming off of that thing because it's kind of melting in this warm water. Each worm only lasts about five or 10 minutes, but maybe that's the key to, to, to today. Well, that's done. Guys, I'm happy that I caught two. I can't believe that's I caught two. Two dandy fish. On gummy worms. But the gummy worms, as you can see here, are starting to just fall apart. Fall off the hook, the fish pull them apart easily. Well guys, if you enjoyed this video, please press the like on it and we'll do another uh, gummy worm challenge at a different lake, hopefully on a day when it's a little bit better. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.